I am uh, Xavier Van Este from uh, brewery The Half a Man, Half Moon in Bruges. We are a sixth generation brewery uh, already for many centuries you have a brewery there. I think Belgian beer is still uh, doing very well. I mean, uh, figures are still growing, export figures are still growing. The importance of Belgian beer is still uh, growing. Uh, of course, because the whole um, market internationally for specialty beer is growing. And of course, indeed, Belgian beer was uh, one of the first uh, yeah, specialists in, in specialty beer, in, in, in what you call craft beer in some countries. Uh, and I think we, we still have kind of a, a leading role in that. But of course, yeah, we, we, are, we have a lot of traditions. We have a lot of traditional styles and you see that uh, some consumers uh, really go back sometimes to, to the real traditional stuff as well. Uh, nevertheless, we, we try to innovate as well. We, we, we do innovations. Uh, in our brewery, for instance, we innovated with the, the first underground pipeline in, in Bruges, for instance, or, or with new products. Huh? We, uh, we, we, we experimented with, with new yeasts or uh, with wild yeasts even. Uh, we eat, last innovation last year was, for instance, the first alcohol-free specialty beer in Belgium. So yeah, we try to continue to innovate and to uh, to to find uh, good approaches to to bring the best Belgian beers and innovations and traditions to to the people. So Belgian beer was craft before craft became yeah. craft. Yeah, actually, we don't use the term craft so much in Belgium. Um, because, yeah, as you probably know, what is craft? Eh? Uh, we talk more about specialty beers, and uh, some some of them are traditional. Some of them are very new style as well. And of course, we get some influences from all over the world as well. That's that's clear. Uh, but it's still a very vibrant and in interesting uh, beer world, even in Belgium. Yeah.